and it's, this is a coffee house or it's how? It's a coffee house, Bear Mountain Coffee House. Okay. These are, she calls them nest eggs, and yeah. she was giving them to, to children in the family okay. to have okay. forever and ever. And they're just dynamite. Okay. Now this is a ceramic... This is a ceramic egg, yeah. And this is with raccoons. I use raccoon on that. Wow. And the lady will be here later, I hope. And this one's fabulous because wow. it's got all kinds of things in here. There's an airplane yeah. and flowers. There's a horse. Wow. Well, I made it look like an Easter egg because I thought it was cool because it's almost Wait. Easter. Yeah, it turned out fabulous. I was really, I loved it when I, I loved it when I saw it. Did you have fun doing it? Yeah, it was fun. Are you going to do it again next year? Maybe, I don't know. <laughs> well, I see that you put a price of $20 on there. I hope we sell it. And that might make you do it next year. Yeah, I hope I do. Because it's pretty fun. A participant in the... No, I'm not. Okay. I'm an admirer. Okay. I can't do quilted eggs. I'm a quilter. Oh, well... <laughs> I could have done a quilted egg, but... Do you have to be artistic to do this kind know, of work? Or of what's course, your... of course, and inspired. And all these artists, they just kind of spur each other on. Yeah. Is Magdalena <laughs> kind of an art community? Is we it? are, we are. Yeah. And it's becoming more and more so as more right. people moved in. Okay. In the last five years, we've had lots of artists, writers, theater people, and amazing people from Europe. Okay. So um, this is the egg that I've done. Okay, now which, it's the egg tree, isn't it? Yeah, this is the egg that I did. Okay. It, it uses seed beads and it's on a duck egg. Okay. So it didn't take that much to do. My first one yeah. broke. Okay, how long did it take to, to complete the egg? How long um, probably six hours in total. Wow. This is the goose egg. Okay. And uh, Yvonne specifically had requested barbed wire. So we have barbed wire all the way around. It's a scene from the east side of the Magdalena Mountains. Wow. And I was out there taking pictures of primroses, which you can't do in pen and ink because they don't show up. Okay. But the scene was nice. So it's just stippled with a, a technical pen. Are you going to enter next year again? Or yeah. Think so? Yeah. Uh, so you, did your mother or your dad help you with these projects? Or? No, I did both of these myself. And these are also my pet's eggs right here on the street. Okay. So your mother does eggs too, huh? Okay. And your daughter. Oh, yeah, well, I'm glad. Did you, did you, did you encourage her into this? <laughs> well, you need she, she's an amazing sculptor, so I didn't have to do much at all, so it was nice, so yeah. And she does beautiful work, it's amazing, so. Uh, how many hours do you have involved in that? Eh? Oh, too many. <laughs> You're embarrassed to say. Yeah. Okay. So it's all it's all organic, though. It's the hair from your goats and... Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. Is there a particular type of artist that comes out here? I mean, are they sculptor, are they metal people, or there are sculptors, yeah. there are metal people, painters, yeah. you know, quilters, eggers. <laughs>